Choose an object. Uh, uh Monocle. Um Ooh, nice. Uh accordion. <laughs> uh oh, a mozzarella stick. Slinky! Okay, uh just uh, yeah. Fellow camper with whom you <gasps> share a tent has brought 20 of this object. <gasps> How unsettled you feel about sharing oh. the tent with this person. Damn it. All right, uh, last place, 100% is the uh, Mo mozzarella, mo mozzarella stick. Mozzarella sticks. Sticks. Mozzarella I want to be in that tent, animal. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, let's see. 20, what was it? 20 slinkies, is it too bad? 20 it's weird, it's 20 weird though. 20 accordions, I feel like they're gonna play something <laughs> oh, that, that I don't That would be annoying, hell yeah. yeah. So, but it's I not about like it annoying, would... it's about unsettling. I would be unsettled by the accordions. I'd also be kind of unsettled by the monocles. Why do you only, you only need one? That's what I'm usually. saying, 20 monocles is unsettling? It is a little odd, it is a little odd. Accordions is like, you know, weird, but 20 monocles is unsettling amount of monocles. Because <laughs> I guess you just really only need the one, huh? Right? If they bring yeah. all different prescriptions, sticks, that's, they that's come a from? good time. Look, not yeah. if you're lactose intolerant, okay? That true, would fuck you true. up. True, true. True. Um, I would say it would go monocles, accordions, slinkies, mozzarella stick. Fair. That's fair. That's fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, so that's I guess fair. I'm just like monocles are not. I'm just gonna eat these by myself. Twenty of them. It would definitely. Yes, yeah. No, that's it unsettling. Would be like, okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Jesse, are you assigning? I think because it's your turn. Uh, yes. Okay. So our first was uh, Is poggers. Pasta. No, no. Uh, no, no. I'm oh, last. pasta. I'm, yeah, pasta. <laughs> And then doop, doop. me, and then you, and then there we go, yeah. Oh my god, we're almost, it's almost time for we're the meteor shower! Oh my god. Shower time! Uh, probably not been. I don't think I've been to the camp dome. I'm gonna go there. Another day at the camp dome. Another day trying to survive a deadly battle royale game. You managed to murder 10 people in 20 minutes. What a feat! <laughs> <laughs> the audience roars. This will certainly give you a lot of boldness. Oh. But wait, the camp dome shouldn't make you gain boldness, but ch but charm. Even if that doesn't make sense, you want charm. Oh, okay. You think quickly and make a fancy hat out of the guts of a corpse. The <gasps> audience is routing grants you plus two charm. Much better. Ooh. Yay. Uh, later you meet up with Joy. She said she wanted to spend this day with just the two of you. Your knees feel weak, but that might be the polio you recently contracted. Uh -oh. oh my god. <laughs> Never Jesus. got your shot, I guess. Oh, hey. Oh, thanks for meeting me, Harapasta Enema. I wanted to apologize for all the drama with my exes lately. You've been so understanding, and I've been doing some thinking. We need more exes! <laughs> Just before Joy can finish, a strange purple slime hole appears right in front of you. Oh there God. are palpable waves of angst and resentment radiating out of it. Oh dear. Uh-oh. Oh shit. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh! Uh, can, can, Jesse, can I have this one? Uh, yeah, okay! Well, well, well. If it isn't my ex-girlfriend, Joy <laughs> Johnson Jojima, also known as the witch who drowned my heart in the obsidian ink of emotional betrayal. Oh. Ugh. Hey, Gerard. <laughs> it's nice to see you too, I guess. What are you doing here, and uh, how are you doing? Psh, I'm not okay, I promise. <laughs> mm -hmm. In the dark of twilight, I was looking into the mirror, and I did not like what I saw, so I began online shopping for the darkest shade of black eyeliner available. Uh, that's relatable. And I saw this post on my Insta feed. You're with Salome, Joy? Seriously? Yet another one of your ice-cold treasons of passion. Another stab in the heart. Uh, Holy shit, I, I am this close to deleting my Instagram. Not that it's any of your business, Gerard, but no, I'm not with Salome. I didn't give her permission to post that. Whatever. You're just deceiving me again. It reminds me of when I was a young boy and my father took me into the city. <laughs> At sea. <laughs> a lying whore named Joy. <laughs> oh, and his name's Gerard. Oh, I didn't yep. even think you about it. it. You got it. Oh, you got it. You got it. That's amazing, oh, I didn't even think about that. Okay. Hey, even though this guy clearly has an amazing fashion sense, you've got to step in. You tell Gerard that he needs to be respectful to Joy, or you'll give him polio. You're defending this soulless wench. Hear my tale of woe, idiot. I consumed 1,891 living souls and became the most powerful necromancer in the universe, just to impress Joy. 
and she responds by getting all mad at me for killing innocents and then cheating on me with some two-bit horny warlockess? Joy is a cheater! Gerard, listen to me. I get why you're mad. I've said it before and I'll say it again. I was wrong to cheat on you when we were dating, and I'm sorry. But we dated a long time ago. It's been years since we broke up, and the coven defeated you. I think it's unhealthy that you're still completely fixated on this. Not suited for TV. And also, I'd appreciate it if you could stop commenting cheating ho with a rotten black heart on everything I post. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps you're right. I haven't feasted on an innocent soul in many fortnights. It's not like me. I'm losing interest in my hobbies. Since you are the grand architect of my pain, I expect you'll have some method to sew my shattered psyche back together. I love how all of his skulls close their eyes. Oh, yeah. I didn't even notice that! Yeah. I guess it's the least I can do. Pasta Enema and I will help you move on by... by... Uh, any ideas, Pasta Enema? Uh... Mm. Oh, man. But hey, it's a start! It's... I honestly, I like this first one! Um... Just because I feel like maybe that's cheating. all he needs. Yeah, I feel like cheating bad all around, and it would be nice to help this guy. So I am gonna go with the first one. You know what you're doing. Hey. Oh, nice. Huh? That could actually work. Thanks for suggesting an actual idea instead of extremely absurd, probable, random bullshit. Gotta say, it's refreshing. Hmm. What do you think, Gerard? Ready for a rebound? not entirely opposed to the idea, but I refuse to lower my standards by even a millimeter. My new romantic partner must be a true paramour. I mean paramour. <laughs> uh, fair enough. You asked Gerard to describe his ideal romantic partner. I guess I'd never thought about it before. It's my heart. I'm slowly drifting into Nathan Explosion and I kind of just want to lean into it. As my heartbreak has been far too consuming, <laughs> but I know one thing. No more heroes. She must be evil through and through. My future boo should be able to stare into the abyss of the cold and feeling universe. She knows death. She knows war. She is immortal beyond the human realm. Also, I know it's somewhat kinky, but I'd like to be able to suck her soul a little bit without causing it to collapse. Oh. <laughs> Lady. Oh, this is hopeless. Such a goddess does not exist. It does not exist. Oh, baby. You know the perfect match for Gerard. You whip out your phone and set him up with... Phaedralt, an ancient heathen deity of destruction. Hot damn! <laughs> this Phaedralt demon looks both evil and enticing. I'm off to my date, and Joy, don't cry. I don't love you like I loved you yesterday. It's better this way. Oh my god, uh, impressive. <laughs> wow, that was the happiest I've seen Gerard, and uh, actually that was the happiest I've ever seen him. I really hope he can move on. He's definitely evil, but deep down I think there's some good inside of him. Aww. I've dated a lot of villains, and lately, it's been really nice to have an ally of justice and truth by my side. We make a pretty good team, huh? Yeah, oh, you're yeah. your own little coven! Listen, Pasta oh, Enema. Oh, oh. Do me a favor. Close your eyes. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. Am I gonna get a kiss? OMG, you have no idea what's about to happen, but your crush joy has never been this intense. You close your eyes. Your body is awash with warm, comfortable, pleasant sensation. Joy cast a spell on you. It cured your polio. You got plus three creativity, and it was hot as fuck. Congrats, babe. What? Yeah, what girl. Oh boy, Thanks, time Joy. for me to. What am I doing with my life? You got this. I believe in you. That day, you find a mirror in the haunted manor, but instead of showing your reflection, it shows you an exaggerated, evil version of yourself. Evil. <laughs> Evil, you says. <laughs> you will never surmount your insecurities. Look at how perfect I am, and look at how flawed you are. Nobody will ever love you. Counterpoint: Many of it your perceived flaws are totally fabricated sim. by greedy companies looking to make a profit by promising that is what is happening. you literally can't control. Good advice. As soon as you say that, uh, evil, you shrieks bloody murder and disappears. Nice. You gain plus two boldness because you're amazing just the way you are. Ah. Um, after doing whatever you were doing at the location you were at the time, you're intrigued to find Damien seemingly playing with a ball, a bunch of sticks. No, I'm not playing with sticks. I'm gathering sticks because I'm doing some high quality craftsmanship to transform these sticks into... Wait for it. Pointy sticks! An absolutely essential camping weapon. Okay, fine. I really don't need pointy sticks. I just wanted to use these sticks. New 
uh, new Swiss Army knife my dad's gave me for camp. Check it out! Here's a bottle opener in case we come upon a wild beer bottle haunting these woods. <laughs> this attachment is a screwdriver. Well, like, maybe if we get lost, you know, we, like, build a computer, use Google Maps to find our way back. <laughs> and then there's a toothpick, which, check this out, is not actually for picking your teeth out of your fellow campers' mouths while they're sleeping. I learned that one the fun way. But my dad's told me that this is, isn't just any Swiss Army knife, it's a hell Swiss Army knife. It's not from the Switzerland in Europe, it's from the Switzerland located in the third circle of hell. <laughs> Since it's from hell, I know it has some sick secret tools that you have to discover for yourself. But I want to use them now! Tell me your secrets, Knife! Tell me! I've been screaming that all day, but it still won't reveal them. It sucks. How do I get my... I almost said, how do I get my wife to show me the hidden tools? <laughs> <laughs> how do I get my wife to show the hidden tools? Um, my wife. Uh, <laughs> 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 Play things that are always funny. Number one on the list, talking like Borat. Uh, always. Let's see. Play truth or dare with the Swiss Army Knife. That's the best way to find out anyone's secrets. Just read Little Kenny Shows His Knife, the super popular children's book that became a bestseller, and also increasing infant mortality by 400%. Oh. The first one. Hey, yeah, I'm so, so charming. charming. That was a gimme. I think, is that the first successful event I've had all game? <laughs> Fuck yeah. I always love a sensible game of truth to dare. Truth to dare is metal. That's how I find out people's crushes. And then I blackmail them and take the fall for the arson I did. I mean, the arson they did. All right, Swiss, <laughs> but the Switzerland in hell kind of Swiss army knife, truth or dare? It feels kind of silly asking this question to an inanimate object, but to your surprise, you hear a metallic voice ringing deep inside your head that says, dare. Mm, okay, well, I dare you to tell the truth. That's such a cop-out. Uh, if you ever play truth or yep. dare and this is your dare, you're that guy. Yep. You are that guy. <laughs> you're the yeah. Damien. Yeah, you're the Damien. No, that's a bitch move, the knife says in your brains. You know that's not how that works. Yeah, See? really. Even the knife agrees with me. It's not allowed. Yeah. yeah, fine. Then I dare you to run around naked. Oh. How can I run around naked? I don't have clothes to remove or legs to, to run with. Oh, are you too chicken to do it? Too scared to run around naked? Are you a mild silver baby? Chicken, chicken. Cheep, 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 cheep. I'm not a chicken. I changed my mind. I choose truth. You're excited to finally ask the knife what secret attachment the tools it contains within, but Damien holds up a hand, stopping you. I know we began with a mission, but now that we've reached the point of having a psychic conversation with a sentient knife, there are way bigger questions to ask. So, knife, if that's your real name, tell me this. Who at camp do you have the biggest crush on? <laughs> no take backsies this time. The knife is silent for a moment. A moment long enough that you almost wonder if the whole thing has been a shared hallucination. <laughs> but then a voice sheepishly whispers, Calculester, he's a sexy piece of metal. Yeah. Damien loves this. You and Damien and the knife cal and Calculester end up having a going on a double date! What? <gasps> the knife and Calculester don't really click romantically, mostly based on political views, but it's not bad enough to make the date awkward. It's a nice evening overall, and the knife gets tipsy. It starts humble bragging about some of its secret tools. So Damien got the knowledge he wanted after all. He's so grateful and promises that when he uses the knife's fire starter tool, he'll burn down everyone's beds but yours. This knowledge immediately gives you plus two bonus and plus one smarts. Yay! The first Yay! successful interaction I've had all game. Yay! You did so Let's well. Go. All right, my options are. You know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back to the lake. Woods. Lake. Oh. All no, right. Lake. No, go to the woods. We have the pea tree. Oh man. <laughs> 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 That's okay. I wanted to see the pea tree because it's so weird. That day you decide to take swimming classes in the lake. You learn all sorts of cool swimming techniques. The backstroke, the side stroke, the Macarena stroke, the mime having a stroke. <laughs> all these strokes sure are fun, though perhaps a bit more medically concerning. Uh, you gain plus two fun. You're so fun right now, Jesse. Very fun. You're living up your best. You're living your best camp spooky life when Aravi uh, sidles up to you looking a little more bashful than usual. Oh, hey there, little snapback. Fancy seeing you here at this place where you often hang out at this time, which I have taken note of. Uh, look, I've enjoyed our adventures as of late, and I wanted to invite you on some sort of normal activity, like a shopping trip. But then I reminded her that she doesn't shop. But then I realized 
I don't shop because I craft my own items, and that could be a romantic date as well! I mean, a productive time that will set us up to be well-equipped for guests. She meant what she said the first time. She definitely doodled Aravi plus little snapback on her boots of potential marriage plus three. <laughs> wow. You misread that because you were looking at it upside down because you were being clingy like always. Anyway, shut up, little snapback. Are you in? Hell yeah, you are. Aravi sets up our crafting table and you prepare for some high quality equipment making. All right, so I'll kick us off. I'm going to combine Potion of Silence with Yeti skin to create a cape of cloaking plus two. And then I'll use a broom, a feather, and a ring to craft a flying broomstick. Next, I'll put a car on a car to make a limousine. You jump in, combining a leather handbag with a very loud screaming <laughs> to create bagpipes. Nice! I'll use pizza plus pineapple to craft controversial food choice. The two of you have a great time crafting. Occasionally, your hands brush against each other as you reach for materials. And is... Uh, is Aravi blushing? You're getting strong vibes that she might be into you, but she may be too shy to say it outright. You should suggest crafting something sexy together to get your flirt on. Use personal lubricant on uh. battle axe to craft sexy battle axe, or use horse legs on a horse to torso to create romantic horse ride. Oh, boy. I mean... That's a tough one. I do like sexy battle axe. I feel like sexy battle axe is Sexy the way battle axe. Yeah. yeah, I would too. Wait, sexy battle axe? How can a battle axe get any sexier than it already is? <laughs> hey, you're always up for an adventure, right? Isn't exploring the unknown a sort of adventure in and of itself? That's deep hex. Let's go for it. You take some lube and rub it over the axe, handle and blade. You show the axe to Aravi, who's blushing the hardest you've seen yet. Whoa. I, I just... I had no idea an axe could get so... shiny. The dripping lube reminds me of enemy blood dripping off my weapons, yet somehow even more... Oh. Erotic? Erotic! <laughs> Are you okay, Aravi? I don't think I've ever seen you this hor... Horribly dedicated to vanquishing my foes? Of course I am, Hex! I always am! <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, sure, but I was gonna say horny. <laughs> Read the room, Hex! Can I? Can I touch your axe, little snapback? <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! You go to hand it to her, but because it's covered in lube, it's slippery and falls from your grasp! It's millimeters away from killing you, but instead it simply cuts your shirt open to reveal your totally tantalizing exposed collarbone! Oh, Pog! Oh, oh my. Did she just faint? Huh? Harami! Harami! Wow, your sexy, sexy collarbone <laughs> and sexy, sexy, sexy battle axe really did that! And now you get the added fun of nursing Aravi back to health when she wakes up in the camp infirmary. Win-win situation. And what you win-win is two charm and one fun. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm about to get a date. I'm about to get a date. are in there. Oh, I'll be lucky if I score anything at this point. I have I been to the woods yet? I don't think I have. You could get uh, Lyme disease. Ooh, that's, that's always true. fun. You could also meet the tree. The, the tree? You were talking about that earlier. I don't know if it's possible. We'll find out. I really hope it's not. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm afraid. Well, what it's What do you mean? Either... You definitely should just go. Okay. Oh. While hiking through the woods, you come across a bunch of delicious edible mushrooms. Those are animals. Yeah. Well, you think they're edible anyway. I mean, you ate them. Oh. On a completely unrelated note, you also meet an ancient, all-powerful god who's timelessly intelligent and also really into vaporwave for some reason. Oh, uh, shit, Pog. You gain plus two smarts from your dope conversation hey. with your vaporwave god. Ah, oh, hell yeah. You meet up with Damien to help him with what he claims is a charitable endeavor. Oh, really? Yo! I believe that all living creatures, great and small, deserve a fighting chance at life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Oh, that's nice. That's why I've been making these tiny magnifying glasses to give to ants. Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> now they can fight fire with fire if anybody tries to use magnifying glasses to fuck with them. I brought them the gift of the flame, like Ant Prometheus. 
Wow. <laughs> Whoa! What the hell is that? Who is this? Uh, it's the camp instructor. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh, Jesse, is this you? Yeah, like Jesse. This is me. To... This is you, oh buddy. Oh my God. And you know what happened to Prometheus, don't you? <laughs> there we go. That's what I'm looking for. Wow. Oh God. Yeah. Arson. He was worshipped as a hero and the inventor of the greatest of all art forms. Arson. No, it was Chan to Rook. <laughs> in a sexy way? No, in a horrifying torture where his liver was eaten every day way. But I assure you, your punishment will be worse. What? Well, I can't direct to Miss Weaving. I feel like I'm actually being reasonably good compared to my classic bad boy antics. I don't know what sort of behavior is tolerated at Spooky High, but in this camp, Spooky, I'm going to hold you to my standards. You think it's an accomplishment to tone down the arson while encouraging it in... Us? Uh. No, 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 Mr. LeVay. You may be in high school, but at the end of the day, you are literally a legal adult, and it's time for you to face the consequences of your actions. Oh my god. <laughs> but that isn't that isn't what my face is made for. He doesn't want to face responsibility. He wants <laughs> to face shenanigans and knife crime and being a badass. Well, <laughs> until your face starts <gasps> oh to behave, God. I'm afraid Whoa. I'm going to have to confiscate it from you. Oh, she's scary. Oh, no. She's terrifying. Ah, ha, you can't do that. In fact, I'd like to see you try. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? His face gone. His face is gone. Oh, no. <laughs> have a nice day, Mr. LeVay. I hope you learn a valuable lesson about what faces are for. My face? Ah, what the fuck? How? What the fuck? How'd you do that? How am I talking? I don't have a mouth. Ah! <laughs> so Damien is understandably freaking out. But with no way to get his face back, the best way to come to his rescue is to convince him that it's a good thing. Oh. You know uh -oh. the best poker face is? No face! Become a poker pro and make a fortune. Oh, no God. face means no more dentist. <laughs> I don't even know what. <laughs> oh, crap. Uh, I don't know. This seems like smarts, maybe? I don't know. Oh, this is not going to go well for me. Go with your gut. What does it say? Well, that hasn't worked so far. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know. <laughs> Oh god. You literally brought art to this world. You can do anything. Yeah, it's true. It's true. I mean The world is yours. Uh, I mean, this one's funny, but it's probably wrong. But I'm always wrong, so uh No No oh. No 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 <laughs> This is no. not my face! Because I still have teeth! I can feel them! I can feel my teeth! Oh well I didn't know that before. I don't even think I could feel my teeth before, but now I can feel my teeth. Ew. Can I feel my teeth? Oh, I, I don't kinda know. Can. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I can feel my teeth and the trap on my skin in a pulsing meat prison. They're in meat jail and I'm the meat jailer. I think I can hear their thoughts. Do oh. teeth have thoughts? It sounds like they're thinking teeth, 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 teeth. Oh, wow. That's a dark eye reference, I think. So it's freaking me out. I'm freaking out. I can't show how to freak it out because my face. Well, my face. I don't have it. Can you help me? I'm trying, bro. Oh, no. You, you pull out a shot. <laughs> oh, here we go. Let me have it. Oh, my God. Drug. Come on. You know what I got to do. Yo. <laughs> Great, thanks. Where was I? Uh. All right. Now, Miss LeVay, could you not last a mere ten minutes with no face before spiraling into an existential meltdown? 
my, my, my. How embarrassing. I wanted you to behave like an adult, but I see now that you are not. Despite what the rumors say, not only are you not a spicy red adult, you're not even a spicy red baby. You're a mere red toddler at best. Uh-oh. I'll give you your face back now, so I can see your devastated reaction to that sick bird. No, I like this face. <laughs> oh, this oh, one's face cute. is so good. This isn't oh, my oh, face. Oh, this is no. my pancake. You got pancake face. Oh, no, sorry. That's my breakfast. I was saving it for later. I'm certain your far inferior face is here somewhere. Here we go. Have a decency to look ashamed, please. Mm. Lovely. Well, enjoy the rest of your day, my mild, mild charge. Oh, no. Demoted down from spicy red baby is more than Damien can handle, and he spends the rest of the day ignoring you hardcore. Ah, boo! Miss Weaving can call him mild all she wants, but the <gasps> players he's giving you are scorching. You lose oh, minus two goodness. bonus and minus one fun. Ah, oh, bummer. Okay, I'm in the doghouse for sure. Meteor <laughs> shower. The last day of Meteor summer. Meteor shower. Who will be my, my summer love? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, please say yes. <laughs> I like that it still says asteroid to the prom. Right. Yeah. We know uh, where we are. The meteor prom. Uh, yeah. I'm taking myself. Well, uh, have you failed that bad that you're like, I'll take myself? Yes. That's yes, what I'm worried have. about. All right. Well, look, I'm going uh, to win. <laughs> I don't know. May I'll try it, but I'm here to get rejected and make everyone else feel better about themselves. So, <laughs> okay, maybe. <laughs> All right, here we go. I can do this. Doop, doop. All right. Wait, are you seriously choose ask no one? You know the whole uh, point of this game is to find a date, right? Oh, I should have done Are you done sure that you too. didn't misclick? <laughs> do you need me to like go back to the return the selection screen or no? <gasps> seriously, you're committing that decision. Okay, weirdo. Uh, you didn't ask anyone oh, to be your summer yeah. fling. You failed. Congrats with a Z. Oh, I don't no. even see the point in narrating this bit any further. I honestly don't know what you expected. Um, sure. Okay, here we go. The rejection. You finally gather the courage to ask your beloved to, which, to watch the meteor shower with you. Us? <laughs> As a summer fling? Impossible! I knew it. It's for your own good. Have you seen how brawny and powerful I am compared to your weak, pathetic body? Yes. It's okay. I, yes, I'm into it. That's why I asked. <laughs> Anytime we'd hug or high five or hypothetically canoodle, I'd run the risk of shattering your entire skeleton with my incredible fists. Well, yeah, that that was the point. <laughs> that uh. means I gotta be with somebody who's my physical equal, and you're not even close. Sorry. It's all right. I got to look at you some more. Poor Dolly. Yeah, poor Dolly. Oh, no, Dolly. Oh, poggers. No. Oh, poggers. This is not this very is poggers. Terrible. This is very unpoggers. This is not this is very, poggers. This is extremely this is weird, champ. Right now, this whole game um, is anti-poggers. Why did you take all those monster scout courses on surviving a bear attack? You should have taken the ones on surviving rejection. Oh no, I didn't know there was any. You should be. You were not ready for this. Ooh. You were ready for a bear attack. You were not ready for a bear attack either. Apparently, since one attacks you right after, and you <laughs> cannot do anything to get your whole face mauled. God, uh, <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty much how my dates go. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, oh, here we right, go. Let's snap here back. We, we go. got this. Oh, yeah, the you, courage you and love to watch the meteor shower. Wait, you want to be my summer fling? Oh my God! I mean, I guess so, but not because they actually like you or anything. That'd be ridiculous. I mean, if anything, I'm just going out with you so I can learn your weaknesses and plot to kill you. Yeah, I'm not emotionally vulnerable. I'm just using this as the perfect cover. It's a date. Well, you. Oh, oh, the last day of camp was amazing. Yay! Before the meteor shower, you and Arabi spent the whole day exploring nearby caves, searching for gold or treasure. You fought lots of super dangerous creatures, and a dramatic moment when a killer mind flayer had you in its clutches, Arabi swooped in to save you. Hex filmed the whole thing and put it on his TikTok. Now the whole world knows you as a Robbie's damsel in distress, and you're okay with that. Aww. Let's Aww. do this! Oh, here we go. Oh my god. You this is big time. This is big time. You go to check on your favorite witch. 
Is this a hey. special ending? It might oh. be! What? Oh, okay. Hey, Pasta Enema. What? You want to watch the meteor shower together? Please don't reject me. Uh, Please don't reject me. I'm grateful for all your help these past few days, but I never really imagined us in that way. What? I just... I <gasps> have to call your exes! Oh, no. But now that you bring it up... <gasps> oh, oh! I've got to admit, I do like you quite a bit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ooh. I guess there wasn't that initial passionate spark, you know? But, but... But big goth. But that's okay. <laughs> like a fire that lights in you, in which you want to destroy someone, but also fuck their brains out. Uh oh. It happened with Axarax, Salome, Gerard, Dimitri, Liam when he was Angelus. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ma'am. Come to think of it, I sort of seem to have a pattern. And looking at it now. It doesn't seem super healthy. Do I always look for sexual partners in my enemies? Why? Looking at it from a distance, it seems like I sabotage myself. I was entangling with evil people who don't exactly rhyme with commitment. But maybe I could break the cycle. Character oh my God. development! <gasps> oh my God! Girl, you got this! Mm, would you uh, want to break that cycle? With me? Yes! Do you even need to answer? I'm your pasta animal baby! <laughs> <laughs> the meteor shower arrives and you share it with joy. Ah, ah yay! Let's go! You wonder if you may live to become an evil ex. The thought frightens you, but <gasps> it is there. Don't do it. But what can we do besides try our best while we dive into the mortifying ideal of being known? The fear is there, real and blunt, but if we eventually fail, then in time we will learn from every error. So tonight, you just hold hands with joy, while gazing at the starry night and wondering about your shared future. Aww. It starts slowly, but it speeds up, as she's excited by the prospects of new, less complicated way of doing things. And you... I have a your spelling <gasps> oh. Oh. Whoa! Oh Whoa! Whoa! Holy That's moly! Special ending for sure. Hell yeah! Joy! <laughs> you see her. You truly see her. Yeah, you do. A mesmerizing yeah. woman who loves unapologetically. <gasps> oh, that's so sweet. A kind soul who's not afraid to lead with power and compassion. A deeply complex person who carries the weight of the world on her shoulders. Oh my wow. goodness! Someone that. In the moments when she alleviates herself from all those responsibilities, can also be the true embodiment of joy. <gasps> oh. I've unlocked a woman underneath. <laughs> oh my God! Yay! We that was did great. it! Yay. Congratulations, Elsa! That's that was a great. secret ending. I Damn! Can't yeah. it. All right. Wow! I was so excited. Hey. So that's Monster Camp, and I promise what? you, you will never, you will never have the same playthrough twice. Oh my yeah, God! Yes. Definitely. I love it. Uh, one of the funny things that is amazing is that uh, I know that that scene where Damien was going talking about ants. There are other scenes that deal with ants, and I'm not saying there's an ant through line through this entire game that leads to an actual story involving an ant, but uh, it's there. Hashtag Antarchy. That's all I'm gonna say. Uh, I I am so excited to play more of this game. Oh, all right, we oh, have to wrap me this up. Too. Okay, right, right, right. We have right. to wrap it up. All right, you ready? Yes. Ready. Oh, credits. Credits. Credits, credits. Here we go. I want to hear this, the credit song. Unless it's just a... Oh, before we knew it, those weeks were gone. But it felt like a hot minute, and it felt like an entire lifetime. That night, we saw summer coming to an end. We all wondered what could come next for us. It felt like the end of something big. Little did we know, life still had many wonders and misadventures in store for us. Now, I'm older and I can see it. How those years became the foundation of the mythology of our lives. Broken hearts turned tragedies sung for centuries. Wild nights became epics treasured forever. Every kiss and every laugh is now a constellation we'll always find while gazing into the starry night, no matter how many years go by. And Ooh. credits. Ah! Ooh. We have animated credits this time. It's so good. <gasps> what? Oh, I'm so wow. excited. I haven't yep. seen this. Yo! <gasps> With all my friends around that campfire. So young and unafraid and ready to start! 
That's that's the line. <laughs> oh, there's Doop Doops. It's Doop Doop. Oh, this is so cute. This is amazing. This is so freaking adorable. That's you. That's Jesse. He's right there on the screen. Guy. Oh wow! Holy crap! Oh my God, that's so adorable. Look at all that. Oh, uh, we didn't get Polly this time. <gasps> Woohoo! I'll get you next time. This is so good! Oh, this is too cute. This is so freaking cute. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's Dana Brinkman! Ah, there's me! Oh, the pizza dude! That's so cute! Don't look oh, at what characters I voice. It's definitely a spoiler. Ooh! Oh, I see some people here I know. I see a lot of people here I know. Okay, okay. God, this animation is so cool! It's so cute. It's really good. Listen. I'm not saying that this is a great pitch for a Monster Camp series, but... No, I was just about to say, make a cartoon out of this! Yeah, if someone was putting together a pitch doc about that, my, boy, my would babe. it be... Look at her, she's doing the best. Oh, uh, I bet you there's a bunch of characters we haven't even seen yet, right? On that oh, you haven't God. seen, yes. Yeah. So, is Batness there? That was Batness. There are 40 characters in this game. Wow! So Are you like, serious? That's so epic many. amounts yeah. of replay value. So many. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. There are many characters that you will not see unless you do multiple playthroughs. <gasps> Dolly right, plays the drums. Uh -huh. Oh my god, I knew she was my favorite. Uh, yo, she's reason. the best. She's the best. She's honestly my, my fave. She came on screen, I was like, well, there she is. That's the person. That's the one I want to date. Oh, I, mean, I, I can't wait. Dolly. I'm gonna. I'm so happy about Joy, but Dolly. I was be... like, I want to romance Dolly. Yes, I'm gonna be streaming this so much. Holy crap. So cute! This he is cute. <laughs> oh, there's oh. uh, there's one. <gasps> one. <laughs> is Amira drinking bees? Oh my god, I think so. Oh, these two, I really, really like them. <laughs> oh, they're great. Polly. Polly is one of my faves. He's I love drinking. Her. He's drinking a heart. Oh my gosh. <gasps> this animation is so good. She's fantastic. This is so good. Oh, we get the crowd shot. Ah! Ah! So cute. Oh. Ah! I love it. I love, I love it. it. Yay. 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 Hyper claps. Yay. Oh my god. That was so much so fun. So many poggers. Yeah. So much poggers. Thank you for playing. Yeah, thanks, now thanks that you for having your... me play with y'all. It was so great. <gasps> oh, I unlocked Now you played something. your first round, you've unlocked things. Woo! Uh, I got I got something different than you. Uh, nice. I got the uh, Wait, what did you what did you all get? I got beats to relax and study too. I got that too. <laughs> I got uh, four different drinks. Um so what you'll find is that the more you unlock in the game, the more you will have access to new monsters, new situations, new weird Ooh. things that can happen. That's fantastic. That's so freaking cute, dude. This is this is Love it. this is amazing. Thank you so much for for inviting us to be a Yes, thank you so yeah. much. Thank you for coming and playing with me. I'm glad that you uh, got to come out and hang and uh, do better voices than I will ever do. I'm glad that I have what? amazing friends who are so talented <laughs> Your and I can fantastic. use so that I can sit back and watch them enjoy <laughs> my game. <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> Wait, where can we where can we find your game, Jesse? Uh, yeah. Monster Camp is out right now. It's the sequel to Monster Prom. Monster Camp out right now. It's on Steam and GOG. And if you're like, boy, where do I find Monster Prom if I want to play the first game? Uh, Steam, GOG, Xbox, PlayStation, and Switch. Yes, and it's yeah. good. It's Monster, really good. Monster Prom's out everywhere, right? Yeah, Monster, yes. Prom's Monster so Prom is so good. Everywhere. Don't miss out on it. Yeah, Yay. it's it's totally worth a playthrough. Uh, I that was actually, if I'm being honest, the first time I've done an on like an actual online game of it where we weren't just passing the controller where one person wasn't controlling everything. Right, it worked, right. It worked right? super well. It worked yeah. seamlessly. Really it was well. Like we were all yeah. playing. Yeah, great. no problem. It was super super fun. 
Awesome. Well, that's it for us. Yay, thank uh, you. More Monster Camp is going to be coming to the channel soon. But uh, be sure to check out all these lovely people on all their amazing things. Um, Elsbeth, is your Twitch literally just slash Elsbeth? Is that what it, what it is? Yep. Twitch.tv slash E-L-S-P-E-T-H. Lucagen, is your stuff just Lucagen all over the internet? Are you just branded Lucagen? Well, I tried to be. I'm Lucagen on YouTube, but for Twitch, you have to add an S at the end. Lucagens. So please do that. Sorry about it. <laughs> So confusing. Oh, I'm just sorry. the worst. There's a, it's so there's hard to find. Behind. And Long Octopimp. Octopimp is just Octopimp. Hey, Octopimp. what's up? Don't... You can find me at twitch.tv slash xdeathscythex42069x. <laughs> and uh, you can follow I was going to my... tell people not to look you up, but now follow, you've already... Follow you've done Zynga. Zynga. Yeah, you've 50, done it for me. Zynga. 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 Please follow my MySpace page. Yes. Yes. But uh, right here's my, my topic. Yeah, Tom, oh, thank you. Shout out to Tom. Wherever you're at, Tom, we miss you. Yeah. Oh, Tom. Yeah, big ups, man. He's a we photographer you, now. He has the money and the time. Yeah. Anyway, that's it. We'll see y'all next time. Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 Hey, JC, what are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a production of broadcast. Yeah, now sing the music. It's a production of broadcast. Bring the strippers and boats. It's a production of broadcast. Now here's an ask and answer one simple question. It's a production of broadcast. You got